So moving into how to stream with the solo. There's three, but there's really four connections available for Live View Solo. And I'm gonna break them down this way. If you wanna go over here, you have the wired connection. That's with your ethernet port. You'll see there's actually an ethernet jack on the side of this unit right here, right? So you can plug that right into your network and get a wired stream. There's also the option of streaming over your Wi-Fi. If you have a really good connection with the Wi-Fi, then that's absolutely acceptable. You can go from the Live View Solo and you can stream that way. Or there are a bunch of options for different modems to put with the Live View Solo. You can get a third party modem. Any USB modem with service will work with this device carried by AT&T, T-Mobile, to name a few. Or you can use the LiveView Solo Connect modems, and that's why I say there's actually four connections you can make, because with the LiveView Solo Connect modems, the setup is a little different than any of the other modems, which we'll get into in just a moment.